guys uh, in this video tutorial we will learn how to use this Arduino GPS simulator although this is not a professional simulator program but it will help you out to understand a bit of working of GPS is with that of Arduino Nano so here on the right top we have the hardware which consists of one Arduino Nano, one GPS module that is Neo 6M, one take for VCZ that is in red color, one take for ground, and one circuit verification button. So first of all, you must have to connect VCC that is the VCC take with that of 3.3 volt pin of the GPS module. In order to connect these two you must have to click on first VCC and then the 3.3 volt button and you can see that VCC and 3.3 volt are now connected then uh, click circuit verification and it will give us the error because all the pins are not connected till so we we can see that uh, here uh, on the lower side it's like a, a ground take so you must have to connect ground of Arduino Nano with this ground take just click uh, and you can see that now Arduino Nano is connected with that of ground now we will come towards RX and TX of uh, Arduino as well as uh, uh, RX and TX of uh, the GPS module so we know that TX of GPS module must be connected with the RX of Arduino and RX of uh, module with that of TX of Arduino so first of all click this and this okay okay click and, and we got the connection that is Rx is actually with the Tx. Sorry, sorry, it is, it is Rx, yeah. And uh, here, yeah. Now you can you can see that both the Tx and Rx are now connected with each other. So now we will we will uh, click circuit verification, and still it is not working because the ground of uh, Neo 6M is not connected with that of ground. Now, now I think that all the circuit is completed. So click on circuit verification and then you can see that circuit is verified. Okay. Now on left side, we, we can see that we have some programming that is very essential for uh, the GPS module to work. So actually the first line is hash includes software serial dot edge. If this line is actually uh, is actually doing some sort of serial communication files for tiny GPS and then float latitude and longitude they are like just putting some some sort of random numbers into the flow data types then we are creating object for this tiny GPS library then wide setup seal dot begin then we will come towards the wide loop when serial dot available actually Arduino is just listening to the serial data that is coming from the uh, Neo 6M uh, what's called as Neo 6M uh, GPS module and Arduino will just print it out serially so we can see the uh, longitudes and latitudes on the uh, you, you, you can consider this thing as the serial monitor the, the black edit box so I'm, I'm also telling you that this is not a professional uh, simulator you cannot say that it is uh, like uh, um, that you can uh, extract some sort of uh, professional um, uh, attributes from this but uh, this is just for uh, study purposes you can use it for study purposes uh, in your university or college uh, but you cannot uh, use it for uh, some high level projects so be aware of it so uh, for it as we know in order to uh, in order to get 
what's called as the longitudes and latitudes you must have to put the programming so by clicking on this yellow button you can see that there is error in coding uh, because the arduino is still not programmed so first of all we have to uh, load the program uh, within the uh, arduino and this is actually by default i just put the uh, right code uh, just just like do one thing that uh, just change the code and it will not going to work so click on the uploading you can see that it's not working again okay uh, and also and you can change any line and it is not going to work properly so okay okay now we are pressing the programming button and you will see that the code is running that is now it is compiling it will show just like arduino that the code is compiling and now you will see the blinking of two leds of arduino nano so that code is burned although all, all, all this is dummy you cannot say that this is this is just a for simulation purposes okay uh, now you can press this button okay and now you can you can put uh, you can click on any on any point of the map and you will have the uh, longitude and latitude although i do not use to set the uh, exact points of longitude and latitude uh, they are also like uh, some sort of uh, dummy but they are changing um, as according to the pixel value so hopefully you got the concept uh, i have uploaded the xe and the link is in the descript description so thanks for watching